Hi everybody. Hey Jane, thanks for having me. Uh, my name is Gordon Levertson. This is my painting Colonia. Um, Colonia is a 12 by 12 inch uh, acrylic painting. Uh, it's uh, inspired by a recent trip I had to uh, the Azores Islands, which is uh, Portugal, uh, but it's out in the, it's like the Hawaii of the Atlantic, they call it. Uh, as you can see, it's uh, quite bright and vivid and lots of uh, lots of warm colors as befits an island. So uh, that was really attractive to me because it's not something I normally um, get to see that often. So I'd done a whole series of paintings from the, from that, uh, that trip. Uh, so a little bit about my process. What I do is um, uh, first I go in drawing with a pencil and, uh, and ruler and I, I draw out my composition and uh, make sure that uh, the perspective is right. So all the all their, the lines are leading down to a vanishing point and because uh, that can look awfully wonky, especially in a larger painting if you don't get it right. Uh, next, I block in the color. I, I kind of choose the colors that I that um, are either there in the in the original uh, photo that I work from, or maybe I make something up that I, that I like. That, uh, for instance, this kind of teal color was not there originally. I just like the the shadow uh, that made a nice contrast with all of that orange. So. Uh, I go in, block in the color, uh, make sure the composition is good. Any changes I need, I can still do early on with the composition because I haven't blocked in, didn't, I haven't started doing a lot of the detail. After I'm happy with the composition and the color and I like that, then I start going in with layers. So it's like basically painting a, a painting your bedroom wall. It's you want two or three coats just to give a good coverage. Same idea with painting. Uh, I like to get as much coverage as I can. Some colors are easier than others. So our friend here, the teal, was was easy. A couple of layers and it was done. This fuchsia was really hard. And I find that, and you would find that with red tones are really, um, you, you need, almost need like five layers of red tones to get that really rich coverage. And that's that. Honestly, that's the same with house paint. If you're you, if you've ever painted an orange or a red wall, accent wall, you would know it takes quite a few uh, coats of paint. So that's just a technical aspect of it. Um, so what I'm really trying to achieve is is just an over, overall cohesion of color. Um, you know, perspective is right. I've got. Uh, you know, a, lot, a little bit of movement in here. I've ca I think I've captured some of the local flavor. You see the barrel tile roofs, which are predominant there uh, in much of Europe, actually, uh, Southern Europe especially. Uh, so yeah, that's, uh, this is Colonia, and uh, that's, that's its story. Thanks for having me. Take care.